This is a 1966 Chevrolet Corvette convertible. I purchased this car in 1997 from a fella in Dunlop, Illinois, and it was sitting in a barn. Well, my wife and I was uh, sitting one Sunday morning reading our local paper, and I saw an ad in the classic section for a 1966 Corvette, and that's all the ad said. It didn't say what color, how much, or this or that. So I called the number, and the gentleman said it was sitting in his barn, and I said, I gotta see it. And when he opened the door, here's what we saw. A Mossport Green Corvette, and the first thing she said, it's not blue. I purchased it in 97, and then I spent almost two years getting it to this condition. The interior was completely ripped, the wiring was shot, the motor was oily and dirty. Uh, it was just a mess. The body, luckily the body had never been hit. Uh, all I had to do was just buff it out. Uh, but the frame was rusty, it needed a little bit of everything, and uh, here's what I, what I ended up with. If the number's correct, and uh, which means that every car, every part that I put on this car, it has to fall, I believe, within the range of a month before the build date to the month after the build date. This is a small block Chevy, 327, uh, 300 horsepower. It's all uh, what they call torque. <laughs> yeah, and uh, first and second gear, that's my favorite. These, these side pipes just sink to you. I took the motor completely apart. Uh, of course, I, I changed the clutch. Uh, just the timing chain, I think I changed. Just, just the, the normal maintenance, but uh, it runs like a top. This car here, what they call the base Corvette. It was as cheap as they built it. There's no power steering, no power brakes. A three-speed Saginaw transmission. Uh, the base motor, the 327. I, I was thinking it was a four-speed. Every Corvette I remember was always a four-speed. So I, I threw it forward, thinking it was ready to go, and the guy said, you better look at that. And I looked down, I said, three-speed? I said, it's sold, I'm buying this. 564 were built with a three-speed transmission in the base engine. 2,311 were painted this color, Mossport Green. Uh, when I take it to the monthly shows at Spanish Springs, the people just swarm around it, and the first thing they ask me, what color is that? From 63 to 67, uh, my all-time favorite. I think this is everybody's all-time favorite body style. And uh, just the looks, the stance, a lot of character. It just, it's got a lot of curves. It's got a lot of, just, it looks fast sitting still. But sexy, yeah. <laughs> my wife went to night school. And while I was working, she went to night school. And she, she persevered, got her degree at Bradley University. And I was so proud of her. I gave her the car. I said, this car's yours. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> I get a most show about my car. I love my wife dearly. We'll be married 50 years next next year in July, July 5th of 2025. Yeah, this is this is her car. It's her baby. And she can do what she wants with it. The amount of people that come up and ask me, they, they, they open up their checkbook when I go to shows. I'll buy it right now. How much? Right now. And uh, I go, no, it's not for sale. But someday that day will come. You know, when we get a little older and I can't crawl under it like I used to uh, and do the maintenance on it like I used to, that, that'll be a sad day when that happens. Yeah, this is our baby and uh, I just enjoy showing it to people and I love listening to their stories.